Well, the first thing is awareness, right? That yes, you, you do, it's not done when the papers are signed and the money is in the bank, right? Uh, that's really just the beginning. Actually, the beginning is a little bit earlier. Um, I think when you announce uh, that the event is gonna happen, um, it's very important to know that everyone, uh, particularly if it's an acquisition, but everyone is concerned about how this is gonna impact me. That's the first question we ask as human beings, right? What's in this for me? Uh, and it can be scary for people, especially if they've had bad change experiences in the past. And so you have to immediately paint the picture of why this is good, not just for the company, but, but personally why it's good for people and let them see the role that they'll play. Um, and then beyond that, um, they will have a lot of questions. You will not be able to answer all those questions because you don't know yet. We're back to the ambiguity thing. But gathering up those questions and then saying we're gonna get back with you every two weeks with what answers we have until we're done is really important. And then once the once the deal is done, I think getting getting um, an integration team together where you have people from both sides uh, for all of the processes that need to be combined and really sorting out sort of what is the best process for us going forward is not necessarily the one from the from the bigger company, right? They may have old legacy systems that aren't aren't the best going forward, or there may be some some third solution we haven't thought about yet. Uh, but to but to really get clarity around what do we need, but to get both teams working on it, uh, so that they both feel like they're heard and they're part of that solution. And then you know you have to you have to go like hell and implement mm -hmm. uh, so that you can you can start getting those quick wins. People can really see that it's going to be successful. Mm -hmm.